Uh, you a fight fan, uh, Logan? Obsessed. You? Obsessed. No offense, Eddie. I'm, I'm an MMA fan. Like, okay. I, want to, I want to do MMA after this. I wrestled yeah, in high school. We can do that, too. Oh, shit. <laughs> really? Yeah, we can do that, too. Oh, shit. Eddie can do anything. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's Halfway through the match, could, make it MMA. Could, yeah, could be no, versus... Uh, MMA. You got uh, Bellator. Four yeah, this last week. Thank you, bro. What do you think about Khabib's performance against UP? <sighs> I don't think Khabib's a human being. Like, I don't know, I don't know where he came from, but in my eyes, he's unbeatable. I, like, no offense, Dustin, but I don't think anyone, like, I, I didn't think that Dustin was going to win. And look what happened. It's, it's pure domination. What about uh, Tony Ferguson? Mm -mm. It's Khabib, dude. What planet is he from? He's from Xenon, dude. It's off to 405. <laughs> <laughs> t t Tony's from 10 Planet, though. That's his gym. Oh, it's a gym here in the United <laughs> States. <laughs> when you go inside of a gym, do you feel like you have the respect of the other fighters in there? We actually, we actually try to stay away from public gyms, just because you never know who's filming, who's talking shit, who wants to just try to prove something. You know, boxing is a boxing. There's, there's, there's a lot of feelings, there's a lot of emotion in boxing. So you can imagine when I, like the YouTube kid, walk into a gym, everyone wants to beat the shit out of me, and you get you get the occasional guy who is not to cooperate and work. But uh, I, I also think I'm at the point where I can hold my own against anyone. So, yeah, I think now I think now we're commanding the respect we deserve. And then Nate Diaz is fighting for the baddest motherfucker belt. What felt, what belt are you fighting for? <laughs> is there a bro? The belts don't mean shit to me, if I'm being honest. This isn't about the belt. I'm I'm, I'm fighting for me. Guys, we have about time for two or three more questions. Bringing to your camp, uh, like tactically, but sure. also inspirationally. And sure, yeah, I'll uh, I'll probably say this in the press conference, but um, I mean, Sh Shannon Briggs is, is he's the two-time heavyweight champ of the world. He's got the most knockouts in heavyweight history, and we brought him out onto our camp so he could transfer all his 35 years of boxing knowledge to me. There's a manual this big, and every day he teaches me a little bit more and more about what it means to be a professional fighter and honestly a cold-hearted killer. That's and that, like I said, that's what I'm becoming, and this is this is no longer a joke. This is last year was cute. What's the most